Hey everyone, Liam here and welcome to my match preview and prediction for the match between Lorenzo Sonigo and Andrei Rublev in the third round of Roland Garros. Let's get into it. Before we get into the video, if you enjoy the content, please like and subscribe to the channel. It really helps us grow the tennis section community. A very exciting matchup between Andrei Rublev and Lorenzo Sonigo. Obviously, Sonigo is more of a clay guy than Rublev, you could say, but Rublev's had an incredible season so far, obviously winning Monte Carlo. Coming here into Roland Garros, Rublev has been playing some good tennis. In the second round, he played against the Corentin Mute, and it was a very interesting match. I mean, in the, the first two sets, he was cruising. The third set, you know, he dropped it. wasn't wasn't really, you know, the momentum didn't shift from the second set to the third set in his favor. And in the fourth set, he went down a break quite early on. So you could tell, you know, maybe the crowd was going to get on him. You know, you know, obviously Mute being being French, they're obviously going to you know back him more than they're going to back Rublev. And you were, I was wondering, to be honest, whether if this goes to five sets, is it going to be a dog fight? And thankfully not for Rublev because he managed to break back quite early on again in that fourth set, and then you know cruised away with the set realistically and got his match done in four sets. It was good to see because sometimes Andre, you know, he can sort of beat himself down when he's, things are not going his way, but he stayed very well composed and, you know, with the French crowd being obviously on Moutet's side, he managed to keep his head focused on the match and got the win in four sets. He's going to be meeting Lorenzo Sonigo, who is in good form as well. He beat Ben Shelton in the first round in four sets. In the second round, he also beat a Frenchman in three sets, Hugo Humbert, who Humbert, you know, has been in good form. In his, it was in good form in his first round match here in Roland Garros. And he's always tough to play against just because he's a lefty. Obviously, he's not found the form that he had a few years ago when he used to beat the likes of, you know, Daniel Medvedev or something. But he's still, you know, a tough player to play in his on his day on clay in France in front of a home crowd. But Lorenzo managed to get through that one in straight sets. And coming into this one, the head-to-head -head is two to one for Andre Rublev. They haven't met in a couple years. The last match was won by Lorenzo Sonigo in a couple, a couple years ago. I don't really refer to the head-to-head -head because a lot of things have changed in those few years. I think Rublev obviously is a completely different beast now to what he was in 2021. And on clay, he's shown some great form this year. I think Rublev gets the win here. I don't think it's gonna be a straightforward match because we've seen Sonigo play some good tennis this year, get some good wins under his belt. I think he might be able to steal a set here, but I think Rublev gets the match done and in four sets.